Hi Libra, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and first and foremost uh, wishing you all a very 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 happy birthday. Hope you have a wonderful year ahead Libra and um, of course not just to the ones whose birthday is yet to come but some of you I maybe have missed your birthday as well. So all of you wish you a glorious glorious year ahead but today I'll be concentrating on your October um, uh, reading. Let's see how what messages there are for you and how you can use this reading to have an even more beautiful month ahead. So Libra, let's begin. My angel spirit guides, please bless this reading for Libra and send them the messages they need to hear the most for the month of October. Thank you. So let's begin uh, Libra. Welcome back all my subscribers, welcome in newcomers, do join us, subscribe to the channel, become part of us, we welcome you in. So let's see what's coming up in October for you. October spirit for Libra. Ten of Wands, the Sun card and the Seven of Wands. You will be lightening your load this month, it seems, Libra. Oh, okay. 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 Uh, six of Wands, Libra. This is going to be a month of victory. Finally feeling victorious. We Finally feeling all right. I've got all my ducks in a row. Maybe currently as I'm doing the reading, you may be feeling, what is she talking about? Look at me. I'm so burdened. I'm so overwhelmed. Maybe with your work. Maybe with thoughts. I don't know what. But this is your current energy as I'm doing your reading. Uh, in the recent past, I think there was some, some wish of yours that you were working towards or something that really made you happy uh, right now i think you could be struggling to get that wish come true but in um, this is your um, october card which is uh, well seven of wands head and shoulders above others i think libras do have a tend to be a little bit pe people pleasing they can't say no to anyone in the nicest possible way they want to take on all the burden of the entire world but uh, i think in october there's some lessons that you'll be learning where you'll be saying uh, uh i think i can say no to a few people i can guard my own energy and uh, refuse a few people and uh, you know not uh, overburden myself and that is I think what is going to lead you to a sense of victory in your life. Before I clarify all these cards of course uh, Libra let's take our Ganesha Oracle card let's see Lord Ganesha has for you for the month of October as a blessing or a guidance or some advice. Lord Ganesha for my Libra gang it's their birthday please bless them with something beautiful or some advice. Lord Ganesha, this one, blessings, <laughs> okay that is a really nice to, card to get on, on your birthday Libra, look at Lord Ganesha, sprinkling rose petals on you for your birthday, beautiful, no wonder there will be going to be a sense of victory this month, uh, let's see if there is a message uh, which says more than I'm saying at the moment and it is the double four which is again an angel angel card of feeling secure and settled and happy, number 44, just give me a second, number 44 is... 77 which is again in the spiritual number 77 77 here it is blessings you are divinely protected Libra Ganesha asks you to consider what exactly is it that you want at this time he asserts that your desires are within your reach the universe is conspiring to help you achieve your aspirations since the universe is in harmony with your desires, the how will transpire effortlessly. Ganesha is bestowing on you blessings of luck, love and new prospects. Be very clear about your intentions at this time. Once you've identified what you desire, Ganesha will work to clear the obstacles and amp up your blessings. Withstand the temptation to succumb to self-indulgence. You're in excellent affluence phase. 
this period will not last forever so be sure to take advantage of it and act of course this is your birthday month i mean take full advantage of that libra and act when opportunities arise resolve will triumphant the principle of averages works in your favor now the more that you perpetuate something that you want the more likely you are to receive that very thing even if it feels impossible these manifestation possibilities are endless and range in subject matter from love to money to success to happiness ganesha teaches that your blessings are continuous the realization of the blessing may not be immediately apparent which i feel right now as i'm doing the reading and we're already in october right you may be feeling what blessings omkara taro okay so ganesha teaches that blessings are continuous the realization of the blessing may not be immediately apparent trust that happiness and blessings are always showered on you what is going on in your life at this moment is external and beyond your control true happiness and blessings lie within in you in your heart and soul so libra you're being blessed by lord ganesha what a beautiful card to get on your birthday month right so or let's also take an angel blessing card let's see what my angels are going to bless my libra gang with my libra um, my angels for my libra gang please blessing for them guidance advice message practice makes perfect so whatever this wish of yours is libra right please go for it because this is the month if you really concentrate i think uh, your wishes may come true why i say that is because your overall energy right now is the six of wands you don't know on your way to succeed in whatever this desire of yours was in the recent past Okay, thank you. All right, let's start your reading now, Libra. Uh, Spirit, why is Libra sitting in the Ten of Wands as I'm doing the reading? Ten of Wands. You wow. Uh, okay, okay. You've been wishing for some revival of something. Yes, yeah, something that makes you incre incredibly happy, Libra. This is uh, this is what uh, is overwhelming you. I think you've been waiting for something to revive or something to restart in your life, which you know is your supreme happiness. This is something that you've been wishing for. This is like your ultimate. goal happiness love i don't know what but this was in your past and this is what you're still kind of burdened with when will it happen when will it happen when will i have a revival of that wish of mine when will it come true so what was the spirit in the recent past was the sun energy was the sun energy something you really wanted to take action in right something you were really ge geared up and you felt like top of the world feeling very confident that hey i'm going to achieve this goal but maybe it hasn't happened yet and you're still waiting for you know things to turn around and this happiness to come to you so let's see what's happening in october then so spirit what can we expect in october for my libra gang what's the seven of wands seven of wands okay Oh, either Libra. Wow, there are endless possibilities coming for you in the month of uh, October. That's for sure. Something that's going to feel good. This is like the universe is behind these opportunities for you. Either you will be starting something brand new. or if this is a message you've been waiting for or waiting to deliver i think this would be the right time right to stand up for yourself and ask for exactly what you want the doors are opening it's like the seven sevens came like the doors of heaven heaven are opening and this again is a seven of cups and we had lord ganesha's card which was a 77 right so 777 which is like this is like the universe is and here here's the universe i mean this is the hierophant this is like the source the source is going to be opening up the doors for you but you may have to take a little bit of action maybe it's it's safe 
what can we expect coming in for uh, Libra spirit in the month of October which will make which is good for them king of cups <laughs> something that's going to make you incredibly happy Libra it's time it's going to be time to take care of you instead of taking on all the burdens of all the people around you it's time to go into self-love and it's going to feel fantastic the minute you start loving yourself like Lord Ganesha said uh, love uh, I mean the ha biggest happiness the blessings are within your heart and your soul the minute you start to concentrate on that instead of getting confused by external influences on your life is when you can have that new beginning okay one more okay <laughs> what is this Libra <laughs> I have a six of wands again I have a six of wands again this is a card of victory once again but what is this I have a I have a king of cups and a queen of cups coming in for October for you. I think the only stress and tension you're going to have is how to stand up for yourself and make that first step. The minute you open, you know, you open yourself up or um, stand up for yourself, the minute you go into self-love and you take that first step, this goes into the background. Don't be confused. If you get an opportunity this month to connect to this beautiful energy of the King of Cups, Queen of Cups, again, this is not uh, a love reading, but yes, this also means into taking care of yourself, following your heart, following your soul's desire. The minute you start doing that, Libra, take that first baby step the world opens up for you because the universe is rooting for you this month and uh, don't miss this opportunity Lord Ganesha said it's your birthday month who knows you know the angels are specially like uh, kind of backing you and saying come on Libra it's your birthday whatever you want we are with you don't get stressed out don't uh, wait around to well just love yourself first and go after your desire this would be the month so spirit what is libra still holding on to wheel of fortune are you kind of libra are you just kind of waiting for yeah see the minute i said waiting for libra here comes the three of wands have, have you just been waiting for you know that maybe the universe is going to just in divine timing things will happen I'll just stand around and wait and you know if I wait long enough if I wish long enough you know but if you're stressing out at night and feeling oh my god you know feeling so burdened and so overwhelmed this manifestation will take longer what spirits advise for you Libra is to actually be proactive and take that step towards whatever this wish of yours is that you want come true Yes, you are holding on, just holding on to that waiting game. I think that you've been playing for very, very, very long. Yes, your ships are just round the corner. You don't notice, but these three wands already have little sprouts growing on them. So you may not, may not see the, this wish come true, but it's almost there. Your ships are right, right, right near the shore. But instead of waiting, I think it's time now to give that signal to that ship to say, Hey, I'm here come straight to me okay so spirit what uh, what should Libra let go of then totally king of wands what's this king of wands stopping yourself from taking action Libra if that's what you should let go of yes waiting for divine timing and stopping yourself even though inside you you could be like really wanting to take that action this is the action you've been wanting to take in the recent past as well. But stopping yourself. No, no, no. I'm going to wait. Maybe in the right time, in divine timing. I'm not going to move. This is total stagnancy. Now look at the opposition here. I have a knight of pentacles opposing the king of wands. King of wands is an action taker. They don't just take action it's like they are victorious in whatever action they take they don't take no for an answer but what spirit is saying you have to let go of stopping yourself 
you have to be the one to move that wheel of fortune in your favor okay so spirit what can become libra's biggest blockage which they should avoid totally in the month of october king of cups okay uh, not being able to express what you truly desire libra running away from your emotions yes and manifesting from behind the scenes yes i think it's time to come out in the forefront you know what libra let me explain this to you what spirit is trying to say that yes the what you really desire is hidden so deep within your heart that uh, you are afraid maybe to express what you truly want you could be hiding this this king of cups has a cup of love but also has a bow and arrow in the other so playing hot and cold i'm not sure i'm not sure basically running away from expressing their emotions right or expressing their wants needs and desires even though maybe in the background you've been manifesting this dream of yours all along what is it doing because you're not taking action it's keeping you trapped it's keeping you trapped this is like being stuck in a position where you're neither going backwards nor forward nor left nor right but stuck because you are running away from expressing or moving towards your goal just waiting or maybe just too shy to you know go out there and claim what rightfully belongs to you so don't let this become a blockage now look at this blockage this person is trapped even though manifesting exactly what they desire but feeling trapped because waiting for the right time waiting for the universe to do something waiting for you know that magical event to happen that everything that things just fall on your lap no that's not going to happen unfortunately sorry libra but the universe is with you if you even take that little baby step towards your dream then see how the wheel of fortune moves in your favor This is a special month Libra Lord Ganesha said that so let's not waste it okay so let's say spirit libra does take action this month and says okay i'm going to go for what i want and i'm going to accomplish this uh, dream of mine how will people be seeing my libra gang let's say their close friends who have their best interest at heart maybe their parents mm, siblings children who love them and want the best for my libra gang Uh, if Libra does take this first step towards making their wishes come true without hiding what they truly want or waiting on divine timing, how will these people be seeing my Libra gang? Transformed. This is like putting an end to your past and having a brand new life. This is complete transformation, Libra. If you want it, please go for it. This is so beautiful. uh why will uh, spirit why will they they close people be seeing this huge transformation coming into libra's life because you're standing up for yourself this was exactly exactly your card november october card right here it was spirit says you have to stand up for yourself maybe say no to things which really don't matter and stand up for the things that truly make your heart sing So they're going to be very proud of you that you're finally standing up for yourself, Libra, and ending whatever happened in the past to transform your life to have this beautiful brand new beginning. This is death and rebirth. How how else will uh, their loved ones be seeing Libra spirit in the month of uh, October? Oh God! Either you will be. taking a new offer or receiving finally a new offer and this is going to make you feel new and refreshed this knight of cups is like you know new love energy but i this like doesn't have to be love it could just be something you know a hobby that you always wanted to start which may, makes you feel very happy there's a newness what knight of cups represents something new and passionate and exciting something that makes you feel happy So yes they're going to be seeing a you may you could be 60 years old but they'll be seeing you having the excitement of a 20 year old to say hey I'm going after my passions that's what we want to see our libra gang uh, you know as in the month of october so i think the basic message that i'm getting till now from here is libra maybe you've been waiting for a very long time to get 
something that really makes you happy but you've been waiting 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 maybe this let's say you wanted to learn to play the guitar ever since you were a kid but all those responsibilities and the neighbors wanting their you know tire changed and the boy at the office you know wanted some help and your aunt called you for something you just can't say no to anyone and in the end you have no time left for yourself so making time for yourself to pursue your passion and taking action not only by refusing maybe a few people kindly but also taking those steps baby steps towards that free time that you feel finally start to get to pursue your own dreams is going to lead you to this huge transformation so that's the message i've got uh, let's see what spirit wants to say what a spirit secret message for you in your birthday month the world wow this is like starting a brand new chapter end of the way you behaved in the past or end of the past cycle or chapter and starting a brand new one who knows many of you may need to travel or want to travel or you know go for adventures uh, spirit wise the world card here as your secret message for uh, libra world card need i say more libra need i say more this is like being that kid once again and saying hey i'm going to take a risk i'm going to jump off that cliff i'm not taking past baggage with me i'm ending a past uh, cycle and i'm i'm going to now take that risk towards my new beginning that's what is going to lead you libra to total victory follow your passions don't be afraid that's the message for october i mean i couldn't have ex i mean i spent a long time explaining this spirit in two cards has give, given me the entire you know reading so happy birthday once again libra i'll see you soon and your uh, in your love reading love and light take care namaste <laughs>